Oh, right. Yeah. Everything's good. It's the problem with TikTok is that it's like phone only. And then on this one, it's good. Hi, everybody. Welcome uh, to the YouTube channel. Um, we're here with Tatiana Ivanova. Yes. She is a photographer. Let me add your thing here uh, so everyone can see it. Sorry for the people on TikTok. You'll get to see it later on when I cut it and put it back up, okay? Um, she is a art photographer and video director. Yes. What I'm, kind of videos? It's like uh, video clips, music video clips. I made like four or five music video clips for oh, nice. some famous band from Russia. Awesome. What type of music? Like rock band? Yes. Band. Oh, okay. Yeah, exactly. Is that who you like to work with specifically, or do you you're just open to like? No, if anybody? I like um, music or band or like project or idea, I work with them. Yeah, very cool. So, how did you get started? What brought you into this world? Uh, what do you mean, in photography and videography? Yeah. Well, first of all, which one did you start with, photography um, or videography? Photographer, I started like 15 years ago. Mm -hmm. Videographer, like seven years ago. Okay. So, yeah, like all right. almost all my life. <laughs> do you, for photography, what's your style? Do you like to capture the landscape or do you like to capture people? No, no, no. People? I always making pictures with uh, people, like a lot of girls, sometimes nude girls, uh -huh. like... It's like provocation style. Uh, it's like my uh, client's woman told me after the photo shoot that it's kind of better than sex. That's it. It's about psychology, about woman energy, sexuality, and so on. I'm like professional in it. Okay. I like that. <laughs> How do you plan your shoot? Like, do you get inspired by the model or do you have a concept and then you come and you, you bring it? No, I have like, I don't know, maybe inside me, this kind of creative energy. And I put my ideas, my creativity inside the model. Models always like a mirror from me. It's always about me. Interesting. Yeah. Okay. So what type of music do you like to listen to just in your uh, spare time? Um, alternative electronic indie. This is my favorite. Yes. I'm going to the concerts very often. Two days ago, I was at Simal concert. And during one year, I've been like at forty concerts here. Oh wow! Yeah. Okay. Do so, you go to the, you go to the big festivals like uh, EDC or uh, Coachella? Uh, not yet. I just one year here. Yeah. So I've been at Burning Man one time. So that's it. I okay. like private concerts. Like, are you going to Burning Man this year? I heard that it's all messed up because of the hurricane. Like you can't even get in. No, this year I missed. <laughs> yeah. This year I missed. Next year maybe. You know, I heard a lot of people at Burning Man are getting upset. They feel like there's too many influencers showing up at Burning Man now. And it's less about like the, the real meaning of Burning Man where you're bartering and you're like living in a community. Yeah. Yeah. It's special reality, like alternative. <laughs> yeah. Too many TikTokers out there. <laughs> Stay home. So what is your... Um, First of all, have you been uh, up for any awards? Do you want to try to win any like uh, directing awards or photography awards? Yes, uh, I had like two awards about photographer. It's uh -huh. like about nude photographer and family portrait. Yeah. Interesting. Mm -hmm. when, when you're doing the nude photography, is it hard to get the people to be comfortable? Uh, it's like... Uh, for everybody, I think yes, because I teach photography as well. So for me, it's simple. It's easy. It's like, I don't know, I have this talent or creativity or something, this kind of energy and uh, like not models only, just normal women feel with me like very comfortable. Interesting. And you have one studio that you work at or do you just go no, all over the place? I, I hate studios. It's like not, it's like artificial interior. I like like real life. I like capture like moments like in the films, you know, it's like I use hotels i use some apartments like i rent apartments for it it's like real like uh -huh. style what do you like a, like a gritty apartment or do you like a palatial estate or like a villa no i just i, I just like it's it's depends about idea i like like kind of retro style like old-fashioned like because it's like a lot of mm, it's artistic space always not modern uh -huh. yeah gotcha that's what mm -hmm. you're looking for is there like uh do you, do you shoot all over the country or are you la based uh, now I live in LA, uh, but I've been like uh, in all Euro Europe, uh, in Russia uh, and some Bali, Thailand, like I shoot like everywhere. Oh, wow. How was yeah. it shooting in Thailand? 
very nice. It's like beach yeah. <laughs> what, what, what the, what the shoots. Yeah, very nice. Have you ever gotten into any dangerous situations when you've been shooting outside somewhere? Uh, dangerous situations. I don't know, like something It's risky, like I like... always like uh, shooting in some spaces in hotels, in apartments, not 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 many places outside. Like, gotcha. Yeah. Who's your inspiration? My inspiration is like uh, the first one is people. It's like, you know, why you like music? Uh, what uh, stand behind music? Like people, musicians. It's the most inspiration for me. This kind of people create the music. This kind of people create films. You know, it's like all about people. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's more of a general thing. There's not like yeah. someone that was like your hero in uh, photography or video directing or anything. I'm inspired by, by uh, film directors, by painters, by music musicians, exactly. So Kubrick, about, Spielberg, yeah, Kubrick, Spielberg, Lars von Trier. How about Shooky International? Is he, uh, <laughs> he's a big inspiration for me. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> <laughs> We're down here at the Shooky Fashion uh, Institute, by the way, the uh, Shooky School. Uh, that's really interesting. I love, I mean, do you see the, you yourself doing this for the rest of your life? Do you want to transition into, uh, something else at, at some I, point? Or? I'm going to be a film director. Like it's my goal next goal. I see. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. My father was a music video director in the eighties mm -hmm. and like back, back, like when all that, when MTV was first starting and stuff. I mean, obviously it's much different now. Mm -hmm. It's a lot cooler. You got a lot more awesome technology to utilize. Um, do you, first of all, when did you first come here to uh, America? First, like six years ago, like twice. It, it was like for tour, like tourists for two weeks. Uh, but now I'm here like uh, a little bit more than one year. Have you been to the uh, Hollywood Walk of Fame? Yeah, of course. <laughs> what, did, what did you think about that? I always tell people, it's, don't it's, even worry about yeah, it. You so can't it's, fit it's, it in. It's the last place you want to visit here. <laughs> yeah. It's They really got to fix that up. It's supposed to be the crown jewel of Hollywood. Meanwhile, you don't feel safe walking down the street. Oh, yeah. man. So um, what projects are you working on right now? Uh, I'm working with my next uh, photo uh, photo course, like for young photographers who want to like study my my experience oh really so, that's really yeah. cool like kind of like a mentor thing yeah interesting do you have a whole lesson plan or you yeah, just of course i have like whole comment like some like 10 people who work with me with it that's great where can people find out more about that if they wanted to partake in the program but mm, like if people wanted to like join up with your uh yes. your program where would they go yes. just uh, to your instagram or no 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 it's like special platform for studying and uh, i upload uh, there like my videos uh like in some different terms interesting do you mm -hmm. edit the videos too or just do the direct uh yes i'm edit but it's not like my favorite thing to do like i delegate this stuff yeah but i i can do it but it's i, I don't want to waste time for it it's like special people to do it how about when it comes to the photos? Do you edit the photos because yes. it's like a little more personal? Yes, I, I always edit uh, edit photos because it depends about mood. It's like a lot of like little things to to shoot to do it. By the way, for people just tuning in, we're here with Tatiana yeah. Ivanova, mm -hmm. and she is at Italia on Instagram. That's yeah. I T T A L I A. If anyone wants to follow her, a lot of great photos up there. Yes, please check my profile. And if you want to be like that kind of style of photography, please come to me. Have you uh, had to work? Uh, you don't have to name names, but like when you're working with the musicians on the music videos, can they be a little difficult, a little bit egotistical? Uh, again, please. Like, do you ever like you go to do a music video and then like uh -huh. the, the, the band or the musician is like kind of difficult to deal with? Difficult to all, direct. All artists, people, it's very difficult. Uh, like like me, yeah, it's very difficult. Like I know how to deal with them. So, um, yeah. Interesting. What's your uh, What's your zodiac? Capricorn. Capricorn. Okay, that makes sense. Capricorn is very <laughs> driven. I'm almost a Capricorn. I'm like a half. I'm right there with Aquarius. So I almost I got more <laughs> okay, of the lazy so. Aquarius side okay. than the Capricorn part. <laughs> interesting what kind of food do you like 
Uh, Thai food is nice. Thai I food? I like it. Yeah. Okay. Some Japanese. Japanese French. food. You've been down to a little Tokyo here in downtown LA? Yeah. It's nice, right? <laughs> yeah. It is nice, yeah. What's your favorite part of Los Angeles now that you've lived here for a little while? Um, I think like um, maybe it's, uh, Marina del Rey or like uh, from Beverly Hills. I just live at Beverly Hills now at my friend's house. It's like I see all view like to the, to the city. It's nice. Awesome. Do, yeah. you, do you hit Rodeo Drive? and mm -hmm. uh, it's, Yes, it's close. Go to some of those restaurants. You got to go to El Pastayo on Cannon in Beverly Hills. That's uh -huh. where all yeah, the celebs yeah. go. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's, yeah. Have you my ever friend lives here. Oh, nice. So you mm -hmm. get to go. Have you ever done uh, taking paparazzi fo photographs? <laughs> no. <laughs> Is that looked down upon in the world of uh, photography? I don't know. I, I, I don't want to kind of like style paparazzi. It's like not for me. Yeah. Those people are total animals, I think. Yeah. <laughs> By the way, I used to work for TMZ, which is like a big uh, celebrity <laughs> entertainment oh, news site. Okay. I did the videos. I did interviews, so it was cool. Oh, cool. I'm not a very skilled cameraman, I'll say that. You must be, though. You you know like uh, how to use a camera professionally and set up the shot and all that. It's Yes, but it's like it's simple. It's like not about camera. It's all about your eyes. Like. Could I ask your opinion? What do you think about the setup that we have here? Because like we were getting this studio going. By the way, for anyone on TikTok who's been watching, we're slowly building the studio. Okay, I'll show you a tour after she's gone. Uh, but what do you think about it? Is it does it looks like if you walked in and this was the video shoot, would you be like, scrap the whole thing? We're starting over. Like you mean what background or what? Yeah, like the background. I mean the this the lights. You know, we'll move those around. But the background. It, it depends. It looks like a little bit chaotic. Yeah. And uh, for me, it's like this kind of mood. I will make like some kind of strange, very strange, like poses and so on. Like, like not, not uh, like normal pose, like some kind of chaotic. Interesting. Like, this center, yeah. I don't want to put any pressure on you, but you know, Shooky is a rapper uh, as well. I don't know, you know, if you, <laughs> if you would ever have any interest in directing the Shooky music video. And he didn't ask me to say this. I just thought of it right now. But I'd be curious to see what would happen. Does he, when you look at Shooky, do you see like a character? Do, are you like, oh, my God, I could work with that? He's kind of like crazy artist. He, he's got, yeah, he's got that crazy artist energy, right? I mean, yeah. this is all his stuff. By the way, that's his piece right there, the the angel wings. Modern art, <laughs> yeah, 10 million dollars. Oh, cool! <laughs> <laughs> oh, you guys can't see that. Hold on, let me show you right there. The angel wings, the classic angel wings. If anyone forgot about them, all right, there we go. We're back in frame, everything good. So, um, music videos, late nights, a lot of work. <laughs> hip-hop you ever do any hip-hop music videos not yet uh almost always rock, rock bands just the rock bands okay yeah. do they make music videos for the uh the electronic songs because i know you said you're into electronic music i don't know yes but like uh, uh i just used to work in russia and i just used to work with some rock bands there yeah like we don't have a lot of electronic style it's like more it's american more how is it out there? I've never been to Russia. What's it, what's it like, like day to day? I think Moscow is uh, like very beautiful city, and like a lot of my friends told me the same. Like, yeah, it's my it's yeah. my favorite city in Russia. What's the best restaurant in Moscow? Oh, it's a lot. Maybe it's like uh, much more than here. Maybe like yeah, a lot. Really, everywhere. Like in Saint Petersburg, exactly. It's like kind of. I, I don't know, like food food city in, in Russia. It's like, yeah. Yeah. I'm yeah. always surprised, like, how tasty is it and how nice, like, creativity, like, about us. It's amazing. Yeah. You ever seen this show called The Bear on FX? <laughs> what? <laughs> it's the one where they're, like, cooking in a restaurant and they all go, yes, chef, yes, chef. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> it's a good show. I don't know. <laughs> Since we're on the subject of restaurants. What about what do you like out here in LA? Any restaurants that stand out? I mentioned Il Pastayo, but you know that's kind of generic. Yeah, I I know some nice restaurants here. 
Nobu, Malibu. Yeah, some Saul's Grill restaurant, you know. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's do you, very nice. Do you care about a Michelin star or does that mm. not factor? And when I it? travel in, like in Europe, for example, like to to discover some new, this kind of restaurant, yes. Yeah, because it's kind of uh, the part of experience when you explore a new city. Everything is like uh, get you emotions. <laughs> Is there any artist that you, I mean, like mu musical artists, I should say, that you want to work with that you haven't had a chance to yet? Uh, which one? Russian again, please. Oh, yeah. Is, is there like a, a singer or a rock band that you would like to direct a video for? Uh, if you know, like Bob Moses, Elliot Moss, for example, um, Neighborhood, maybe like this bands. Okay. How about Ice Spice? You know what is it? You know what I, Ice Spice <laughs> with the red hair, the curly red hair. She's kind of a rapper more than anything. Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift. She was just here doing a, a major thing at uh, mm. SoFi for like six nights. Any interest in Taylor Swift? Uh, you would, would you want to direct for her? Mm -mm. Really? I'm interested. Oh, that's an interesting answer because she's like the biggest artist doing it right now. Hello, Idaho, <laughs> by the way. We got some fans from Idaho watching. So no Taylor Swift. So you're not really a mainstream type of person. You're, you're more like an alternative and, yeah. and whatnot. Yeah. Okay. You didn't go to the Taylor Swift concert by any chance, did you? Mm -mm. No. Yeah. <laughs> One of our guys who's usually here was there for like six straight nights. Got a bunch of great coverage. My next concert is Jungle. Jungle, Nick Cave, Bad Seeds, Deepish Mod. Like this kind of music. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Now I'm in the position of not really having heard of who you're talking about. <laughs> okay. Sorry. Sorry. I'm no, I got to admit, my, my tastes are, are vastly commercial, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. I'm, more of a, I'm more of like a podcast guy than a music type I'm of guy. I'm a vinyl girl. Yeah. Vinyl? Mm -hmm. Oh, nice, nice, nice. You got a big vinyl collection. Mm -hmm. What do you have like a like a vintage record player or did you buy something that's no, more I new? No, I buy like uh, new releases as well. Just listening to the vinyl, just it's it's kind of more interesting. Do you have like a collectible piece of vinyl that you that yes. you cherish? Mm -hmm. What's mm -hmm. what's like one of your favorites? Uh favorites. It's like maybe um, Nirvana, Kurt Cobain, Bjork, Burns. Um, David Bowie, Beatles. Yeah. Like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are the ones I see. Whenever I go into the store, I see with the vinyl section. It is a lot of Beatles. It's a lot of it's a lot of Taylor Swift. Actually, I heard her fans, by the way, were a little upset with her because she keeps reissuing these vinyls and they feel pressured to buy them. Just as an aside, I know it's not that important. But uh that's interesting vinyl vintage you're kind of like a vintage you know in a way like you, you like a little bit of like the the classic yeah. uh classy stuff mm -hmm. old fashioned sometimes yeah i think it's like uh a lot of history in this kind in this type like it's not modern it's not new it's like already checked by time like you know i love that Mm -hmm. I see we got some questions. Any collectible silicone pieces? Does anyone know what that means? Mm -mm. Is silicone a thing that people are collecting now? Uh, by the way, again, for anyone just joining us, this is Tatiana Ivanova. Yeah. Right. Photographer, <laughs> yeah. music video director at Italia, I-T-T-A-L-I-A on Instagram. You can follow her. Check out her portfolio. Yeah, thank you for listening. Anything else you want people to know? Just and come to my shooting and you will get a lot of pleasure. Like I promise you, it's like kind of art and you like open inside you like some more uh, interesting part of you. You never know about it like that. Now, wait, when you say come to your shoot, are you saying that people can actually show up to your photo shoots or just... Like everybody can order like me, like a photographer for photo shoots. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Mm -hmm. Do you ever have like a gallery show or like an art show where people can uh, come and see I your had, stuff? No, uh, I had like my uh, own exhibition here, but it's kind of a temporary. So like uh -huh. a lot of my works in my Instagram. 
So by the way, her Instagram, I'll pull it up. And for the TikTok people, I will put it up there when I uh, edit this later on. Um, it's pretty interesting stuff. I'm looking at it right now. Yeah, a lot of great photographs. I mean, you definitely have an eye. Fantastic stuff. Well, listen, anybody got any questions yeah, real quick? Man, woman, couples, everybody. Man, woman, couples, you can get everybody. <laughs> oh, thank you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They put that up. Thank you, Dana. Appreciate that. Thank you. Awesome. Well, so then what's coming up this week? Anything interesting? Uh, I'm just going after this to shooting. <laughs> oh, nice. Stay busy. Yeah. Always working. All right, cool. Well, listen, it's been a pleasure. Thank you. Thank uh, you. Anything else you want people to know uh, before we wrap things up? Um, just if you like my works, just uh, make a lot to have this experience. It's really fantastic. So it's all my life, what I do on this is. Beautiful. You Are you on TikTok? Uh, what? Are you on TikTok? Uh, yes, but I'm not like super. You don't really post. Yeah, yes. more of an Instagram. On Instagram. <laughs> yeah. Gotcha. 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 Any uh, one last thing. Like, what's what's your latest music video that's out? If people want to go check it out on YouTube or something. Uh it's it's Russian. If yeah, I I can find it, but it's on Russian. Like the name of the band is Russian. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah do you, I don't do you, know how to find it. Do you post any of that on your Instagram, the yeah. music video stuff too? Yes. Oh, okay, go to her Instagram. Mm -hmm. what's, what's taking you so long, everybody? Go to her Instagram already and find her stuff. It's actually really cool. I wish you could see it on TikTok. I'm looking at the page right now. It's really, it's really great. It's really interesting. Well, Tatiana Ivanova. Guest on the Dante Greco show today here at the Shooky International Store. The highlight of your career so far? Mm? Was this the highlight of your career so far? Uh, to be a film director or something. No, not being on this uh, show no. is not the highlight. Oh, okay. No, no. <laughs> sorry. I figured uh, it's okay. It's my native language. So no, 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 no. It's okay. <laughs> All good. All good. All right, everybody. We're going to say goodbye to Tatiana and then uh, I'll be back in just a few minutes. Okay. Okay. Bye bye.